friends. So it is Saturday morning and I am hiding in the laundry room. My husband is in this back corner paving a corner of our house. So if you hear chiseling, it's that. Anyways, so I am going to be sharing with you guys a very insane clean with me because we are preparing to leave for a week to go visit family and yeah I have so much to do and we only have a couple hours today to do it so we're gonna try to get all that done while the kids are entertained they will be coming in and helping me with their rooms but I'm just letting them do whatever they want to do right now and right now they're playing all together so we're just gonna leave that be and get what we can done. The kids typically in the mornings, they have to get a set amount of things done in order to get some screen time. And so I actually have requested that they pause on doing that today and then I will grab them for them to help me with certain things today because rooms are a mess and I need to strip Nash's bed, the Little's beds I have cleaned, I need to make their beds with them and then I need to make sure that the clothes that I'm pulling we have all the clean ones that they want to wear while we're there and all that and now that they're older it's like I like to get their input with what I'm packing because you know I don't want to be picking what they're wearing like they should pick what they're wearing want to wear okay so here we go I might just do a lot of time lapses and voiceovers so just be with me because <laughs> It's crazy and it's harder to film and then talk to you guys than to just put the thing up and then time lapse. So before I leave you with time lapses, grab a room, grab a thing of laundry, or just sit and sip some coffee or iced tea, or whatever the heck, and enjoy. Over here, Sean has a basket of his clean clothes and what he's gonna pack for Georgia. That is some stuff that I've pulled for me to pack for Georgia. So yeah, that's what that is, but cleaned up, ready to go. Okay, so I'm gonna do this room now. Okay, so y'all are just gonna have to bear with me with this video, with my voiceover. I have tried to voice over this video multiple times. My husband is, like I said, working on the pavers and my kids are playing or watching something entirely too loud in the background. So I'm hiding right now, trying to get this voiceover done, but literally every minute they're trying to come and need something from me, you know? I mean, mom life. But right now, I'm just cleaning up the kitchen, getting everything kind of cleaned away. I like to, you know, deep clean the microwave, get into the nooks and crannies before we're about to leave the house for a full week. And then, um, as I mentioned later, we're kind of just trying to eat all of the stuff out of the pantry and the refrigerator 
before we leave for a week. And then the things that we can take with us, we kind of pack away in a cooler or bags to bring um, on our little trip. So here I'm just cleaning out that microwave and then I'm going to clean off the countertops and the kitchen is feeling so much more clean and it is sparkling at this point. Um, we are just going to move on now and I'm kind of showing you, but in the background was a lot of noise. So I chose to just do a voiceover. Now we're moving on in the dining room and the living room, cleaning off the table. Um, I kind of wipe down this tablecloth and then store it away and then bring out a clean one. I love these wipeable tablecloths. You can get them for like five bucks at Target and I reuse them. I don't know if you're even supposed to, but I do. And they're great. And I can't even remember which, I think it's, uh, I don't know. It's whatever the party line is back there. Um, but I'm going to fold this sucker up and put him in the linen pantry and pull out another one. I don't know if you guys heard that, but that was uh, someone coming into the door. <laughs> you guys, it is laughable. Anyone else just constantly, constantly needing to do things? For their family just me okay cool so here i am putting out now this one i got from threshold i love when they have these wipeable tablecloths and this is one of my faves they're just they lay so nice they don't leave a bunch of creases if you find them grab them they are so good the hearth and hand line has some wipeable ones i haven't tried those out yet so I'm going to have to do that because I do want to try it. Anyways, cleaning off the dusty dusts of the windowsill and my little buffet area. Oh, wow. oh no. This is like what we did. Oh. oh. That is just like the splash pad we were just at. How cool is that? Oh, it's so fast. Oh, it's like this. Oh, okay, so here I am folding the first load of laundry. I think I folded like four loads because I wanted to get all of the laundry done and folded and put away before we left and all of the living room and dining room was cleaned up and sparkling so I wanted to show you the after and yeah looks so good and then here I'm just showing you you know I love those screensavers it's like watercolor museum ambiance on YouTube and would it even be a well, y'all, if it ain't the kids, it's the husband. You know what I mean? Anywho, here I am cleaning the bathroom. This is the, our middle bathroom, pretty much like the kids' bathroom. And I basically clean this every day. I'm going to refresh the hand towel as I do every day. And then we go into the boys' bathroom and got that sparkling. All right, so I was starting to panic because, oh my gosh, her room was a wreck, but she came in, she cleaned it up, and I gave her a little bit of assistance so she wasn't overwhelmed, and now it looks so nice, and it'll be ready for her to come back to it with all the things and clean beds, and she did such a good job, and she was so proud of herself. She had on her Taylor Swift music. Um, anyone else put on music to clean to? My kids know to do that because it makes it much more fun. All right, boys room, pretty good. I'm gonna come in and kind of clean up a little bit. I gotta dust, but um, it's pretty cleaned up. All right, boys room, looks good. The kids are watching the investigators, or investigators, I don't know how you say it, but they love that show. Boys room looks good. All right, you can see your girl is losing steam. <laughs> I don't know what time this was, but I was tired. And I'm folding a, another two loads of laundry, trying to pull out things that I might need for our trip, but then also making piles so that the kids could put away their laundry. And at this point, the kids were just chilling again. We had done a big clean and I'm about to show you how we did our store. We opened up our weekly store that the kids buy things for their little fairy gardens or their creature gardens with marbles and it's fun. Anyways, here is my lunch uh, egg salad. Uh, I love it. 
with black olives. Sorry if you don't, but yeah, just whipping that together and gonna make a yum toasty sandwich. And stick with me because I'm about to share with you that store I was talking about. The shop is open. We've all counted our marbles. Now, here's what we got here today. We've got, okay, so these in the top, we have, this is going to be 15, 10s, 10, 8s, and then in here, we have fives are these bigger ones fives and then we're just going to go ahead and just say all these are threes except for the little ladybugs do you know where the houses are what houses we bought all of them. i think you guys bought all the houses last week i have to you get more two. huh and i guess what you could also switch with someone if someone wants to switch something mm. my citizens thriving thriving citizens my citizens that i haven't paid for yet thriving <laughs> Oh, yeah. Wait, Not all down? of them. Okay. <laughs> it is later in the day. We planned to clean the whole house, tidy up the kids' rooms, and all of that. We've been eating through the pantry and the fridge. So the last little clips that you saw were from my egg salad that I made. For, lu for lunch for me. It's three right now. The kids ate a while ago, but I was just like kind of barreling through. Um, we got everything done. The house looks great. I'm going to do one quick little sweep and then I'm going to finish up with just getting all the kids clothes ready. I don't know if I'll even show that, but if I do, it'll just be at the end, a little time lapse. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you like these kind of get it all done with me videos, like it and subscribe. Make sure that you've subscribed because I don't know if you guys are like getting that I've uploaded videos or anything. And um, yeah, the algorithm just does not like me for some reason. You know, let me know below if you can identify with my pimple patch. You know, this pimple's been a bugger this week. All right. See you next time. Bye y'all. Love your faces.